Yo, what's going on, everybody? Thanks for tuning in. And if this is your first time, I really appreciate you watching, all right? Uh, today, we're going to be doing something that I hope makes the heads explode of all the denim purists out there. Take one guess at what you think that'll be. That's right. I'm going to put a pair of unwashed, unsoaked Brave Stars in the washing machine, wash them, and then throw them in the dryer and dry them. But anyway, that's just me talking. Let's take a look at these jeans and get this project going. All right, so there they are. You know, this is my laundry room, all right? I don't have any really fancy studio to do my denim stuff. So you got, you know, kids' bike helmets over there. You got a dirty sink over there. But just focus on this right here, because that's what we're here for, all right? Like I said, these are the Brave Star, Die Hard, Double Knee, Green Dragon. Uh, double knee work pants that I got from Brave Star, right? So like I said, I wore these for some projects. They definitely are not clean. I got like a triple cuff. Seriously, nothing fancy going on here, guys. Treating these like like work pants. But look, you got dirt. You got you got all types of stuff going on here from wearing these uh, some projects. All right. Again, I'm just kind of scrolling over here. Nothing fancy. Literally, people, this is not a fancy uh, Japanese cuff. But yeah, so that's what we got. So like I'm saying, man, nothing fancy there. Let's flip these over. We'll look at the backside. My booty doesn't look as good in these because these are the straight fit. But hey, none of you guys are here for that, right? Well, there was that one subscriber who said I had a nice posterior. I think that meant butt. But yeah, let's look through here through my, my influencer rim light. All right. And yeah, honestly, we got some good, you know, we got some good honeycomb going on back there. There's still some stacking. I think these will have some cool fades for work pants. Um, one of my subscribers, uh, I forget who it was, pointed out that he thinks they put the tag here and not a patch here to kind of coincide with the look of other work pants. If you've ever wore other brands, they usually have the tag right here, okay? All right, so that's this. Now, let me get my camera set up. I'm going to show you how I'm going to wash these in the washing machine. And we're going to turn it on. So we're going to throw them in. I'm not even going inside out, okay? I'm going to throw them in there. Now, so I'm going to do a cap full. I'm going to close this. Close the lid. Jeans. We're going to do cold water, uh, heavy soil, go no spin, all right? Like your start button. All right, just throwing them right in here. Generic dryer sheet, right? We throw this in. We set a time dry on here. That's it. we turn it on. All right, denim heads. I don't think I'm as satisfied as I thought I would be. The main reason being is that they lost all their rigidity. Now they're just, uh, these are 15 ounce, I think, or 13, I forget. But that's just the weight of the denim now. There's none of that stiff, starchy rigidity, uh, which means we're probably not going to get any more fades put into here from creasing. Outside of that, though, I think they shrunk up a little bit, so we'll do the fit test in a moment. But I'm talking a lot too much. Let's turn this camera around, take a look at the jeans, see what we think, then I'll try them on, all right? Okay, so here they are. I will say, it might be hard to see now, but there's definitely a green pop coming in. Uh, for that green dragon element they were talking about. You can see it a little bit here. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna get that. Uh, hopefully the camera picks that up. But yeah, there's definitely some green hues coming through ever so slightly, all right? So we'll just kind of come around. Like I said, man, you're not seeing much fading right now uh, in terms of what we're looking for, but these are work pants. That was the whole point of this, right? Uh, another thing I wanna point out, uh, you're gonna start seeing these nubs popping up from time to time on here. I don't know if we can get up close and see that, but there's gonna be little nubs uh, of the denim that pop up, right? And that was also part of this uh, process. As you wear these, you'll get these nubbins. Let's flip them over. Again, we had all that good honeycomb going on in the back. Uh, you definitely don't see that now. Uh, just, just like I said, just some regular jeans here, all right? Some regular work wear denim. So here we go. We can see a little bit more, I wanna say, of the the green dragon pop coming through here, all right? Fitting really nice, uh, shrunk them up a little bit through here. They're not as barrelly in the legs, all right? Not as much of a barrel leg fit. Um, I think my butt still looks really good. And yeah, I mean, not as many fades, but overall these shrunk up and definitely fit a lot better. Uh, overall, first things first, would I do this again? I would do it for a pair of raw work denim, but not for a pair of my regular other everyday raw denim that I wear. For those, I'm probably still gonna do the soak in the tub, 
hot or cold water, inside out, not inside out, doesn't matter to me. Uh, but I'm gonna avoid the washer and the dryer. That's because I really like the stiff feel of denim and I really love to get them super distressed over time. Uh, if you do the washer dryer, you don't have that option because they loosen up a lot. They're not as firm. These are really not as stiff right now, but they feel good. Uh, one thing I will say, since this was the straight cut, I think a straight fit or whatever, throwing them in the dryer after washing them shrunk up the barrel leg and I feel these look a lot better, all right? The waist tightened up a little bit too, but we all know with denim that that's gonna expand over time and we should be good to go. But overall, you know, denim, it's your perspective. Fashion is your perspective. It's what you want to do, not what I think you should do. So just do do you. Do what makes you happy. Do what you feel is going to make the jeans represent you best. And that's that. If you have any questions, drop them in the comments. So make sure you watch this video. Hit that like button and help me get some new subscribers. So thanks for watching. Take care of each other out there. Be kind. Peace.